All right, this is Stalker Call of Pripyat. It's the second installment of three of the Stalker series games. We already did the first one, uh, Shadow of Chernobyl, like seven or eight months ago. After this is a Clear Sky, which is, what do you call it, a prequel? I played it before. Eh, was whatever. But, uh, funny thing, I've been following the new Stalker that's supposed to be coming out, uh, Heart of Chernobyl, for a long time now, and I looked it up months ago, and I remember saying it's coming out in December of 2022, and I just, it just hit me, that should be coming out soon, I should check on that. And I clicked on it, and then I realized it said coming out December 2023, so we have a whole year to wait for, for that game. <laughs> but, uh, I guess that's alright, because I wanted to, uh, do a video on Stalker Call of Pripyat for the longest time, so we'll just start with this one. At 0123 on April 26, 1986, the reactor of Power Block 4 of Chernobyl NPP is destroyed following a series of thermal explosions. The resulting radioactive cloud moves across the European part of the USSR, Eastern Europe, and Scandinavia, eventually reaching America. The consequences of the disaster are so serious that the government is forced to begin evacuating the residents of nearby towns and villages. A 30-kilometer exclusion zone is created to stop residents from returning to the contaminated area. Despite the disaster, the Chernobyl NPP continues to operate. The existence of a power station, as well as the fact that the area is no longer inhabited, leads the Council of Ministers of the USSR to set up a network of secret laboratories in the exclusion zone. June 11, 2006. The exclusion zone lights up with a flash of blinding light as clouds can be seen evaporating in the sky. After a moment of complete silence, the peal of thunder shakes the ground. Most of the government forces guarding the perimeter are killed instantly. 2008. Scientists are still unable to explain what happened. Rare expeditions into the zone usually end in tragedy. The survivors telling stories of mutated animals with incredible abilities roaming the area. According to various estimates, by 2010, the zone is home to between one and 300 unknown individuals. They call themselves stalkers and make their living by collecting anomalous formations known as artifacts which they sell for considerable sums of money. 2011. Despite military cordons, the stalker phenomenon is growing in numbers. However, stalkers travel primarily around the zone's edges, with the center remaining terra incognita. The few attempts to penetrate deeper into the zone have all ended in failure. 2012. A stalker called Straylock solves the secret of the Brain Scorcher, a man-made emitter that had blocked the way to the center of the zone for years. After the Brain Scorcher is disabled, all stalkers rush for the center of the zone, some in hopes of finding a treasure trove of artifacts, others in search of the Wish Granter. The government decides to launch a large-scale military operation, Operation Fairway, as it came to be known, involves using maps of anomaly fields to maneuver helicopters to the CNPP. Despite meticulous preparation, the operation is a failure, and none of the helicopters return from the mission. Major Dektyrov, a USS Special Agent, is sent into the zone to investigate the disappearance of the helicopters. Disguised as a stalker, Equipped with a regular assault rifle, two weeks' worth of supplies, and a radio to communicate with HQ, the Major begins his journey towards the center of the zone. Okay, here we are. So we're basically like a secret agent. And, whoa. 
the little bunch there. We're gonna get him. So we got two guys coming somewhere over here, if I remember right. Over here, right? Yep, there they are. Now, gotta take these guys out real quick. They're friendly. See, no problem, no problem here, guys. No problem. Now, why did I do that? Eh, because I need, uh, you know, I need to steal what they have. I need to make money. That's why I'm here. Well, kind of why I'm here. I need their supplies. And we got some good supplies from them. I, uh, oh, pick that up too. Pick up that shotgun. This guy, yeah, they got some good stuff. <coughs> I'm not taking the, uh, well, maybe we will take the handgun. However, I have not played this game uh, seriously for probably... I don't even know, dude. Like, maybe seven years? I have the graphics kind of turned down low. Helps it run faster, but uh, it's just kind of funny how you remember you know, everything about, like, I already know where I'm supposed to go. Uh, the... So here is our map. We start out here. These are the helicopter locations we're supposed to investigate. However, there is, there's the boat, or like the base is. Maybe it's that one. Yeah, that's the base. But uh, I always think it's just uh, kind of amazing how seven years later I can I already remember everything about this map so it's not going to be as exciting as you know watching someone play it for the first time when you know where we're going and everything but um, I still wanted to play through it one more time I forget how yeah there we go <laughs> Yeah, this game has uh, some meaning to me, because the last time I really was playing... Oh, shit. Oh, oh, oh. is uh, Skardowski or something. It's like one of the bases here. Yeah, some old rundown ship. Anyways, let's go in. Check things out. Oh! I kn those are the uh, Bloodsucker guys. Oh, I can't pull out my weapon here. Whatever. Listen up. Sultan wants to see you. I hear you. This is like a little bar area. How you doing? Welcome oh. aboard our swamp icebreaker. <laughs> Let's trade a few things. Do we have anything to trade? Let's trade the vodka. That's not worth much at all, but let's trade the soda, or energy drink, I should say. I don't really use that. <laughs> Pop in if you find any artifacts, and you'll see what we can do. You know what? Hello. Uh, well, good luck to you. Well, I'm not going to do that right now. So, 
these are like the sleeping rooms and oh no my storage room is in here <coughs> the sleeping room here's our gunsmith. I'll be gunsmith is also an alcoholic if any of you were wondering we will repair this wow that's a lot of money but yeah we'll repair it Let's repair this one too. Hopefully we'll get enough money to, uh, you know, make our money back. Oh, not enough money. Fuck, I'm already running out. Okay, well, let's try to sell some of this stuff. <coughs> so? So? Need goods, information, or maybe you want to sell information. Nope, I want to trade. Trade that shotgun. That little AK. Grenades I don't need right now. Which one is the better? That's the better one. Those uh, are the radar detectors or whatever so you can find um, artifacts. Okay, keep that. Sell that. This will be our secondary weapon for now. We made $2,315, so like we made, I don't know, what do we make? Maybe like 150, 200 bucks on there or something? Okay. So. Oh, my body armor. Oh, yeah, right, my body armor is still damaged. This. Well, we'll hold on to that for now. It's still early in the game. <coughs> so, <coughs> just to get the hang of this again. So our stats, this keeps track of everything we killed. Two mutants killed, we killed two stalkers. We murdered them, actually, but... <laughs> this is our, like our journal, our diary. The most powerful enemy we killed is the hog favorite weapon is the snub nose AK area map so let's go over here first and browse that area we got enough benches enough food yeah we're good let's go help these men out, out here because they obviously need our help I can hear gunshots and all that Guns sounded like a uh, HK. The uh, what is it? HK 93G? <laughs> HK 93. That I heard firing, and if someone has one of those, I want to kill them right now and get that. Stalker, if you want to get on board, put that gun away. Nope, I will not. Lock down Skardovsky for, I don't know, like 15 minutes or something. Also, there are anomalies where it's kind of like a loud thunderstorm in this game. And when that happens, you have to take cover or else you die. So you always want to make sure you're near something. Okay, so let's go this way. playing on like a hard difficulty or anything because I kind of just want to run through this quick. So, we 
have. Whoop! Okay, yeah, the, the wall damage, thank you. Didn't want to have that happen. Like I said, I know this game so well. There's like two or three yep, two or three guys up here. Where you guys at? There you are. There's five guys. You know what we're going to do? We are going to save game. Save. Because I think I might do a little murdering right now. Okay, you doing good? You guys okay? We're all friends here, right? So you're not going to do anything when I start. Shit, run, 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 run. Okay, and duck. I forget what the auto... Oh, wait, F1, F1, that's all I need to hit. Okay, got him. We got one more guy somewhere over here. Where are you at? Hit, hit. Take that, sorry brother, but oh my god, yeah. Just part of the game, just part of the game. Unload. <coughs> Ooh, a beretta. I will take the beretta. AK ammo, take that, take the grenades. Okay, we will take all this stuff. And also, we will save again. It's not the nicest way to play the game, but it's the way to make a lot of money, and that's just the way it is. Sorry. Seven pounds left. Where's our... Okay, so here's one guy. We already looted him. This guy. We already looted him. We looted him. Him. We looted him, right? Got Got him. Huh. Okay, well, whatever. So. Quickly get this done over here. Oh, also. We're going to switch to this gun. Unload that gun. Drop those shitty shotguns. We don't need those. There we go. Beretta. We'll stick with that. Beretta is the gun I carry in real life, too. In my opinion, the best handgun ever. So, we are going to need you. <laughs> the anomalies. Oh, 
grab that. Got an artifact. Add one. The electronics inside burned out. Even the power cable sheaths melted. series. I'm hoping to get it done in uh, like 10. <laughs> we'll see. I Maybe I'm wrong. Let's over here more. But uh, yeah, so I'm trying not to do a bunch of side missions and all that. So you know what? Forget that other that other sewer for now. <laughs> I might do a few things offline. <coughs> so we don't make this too long. And we're going back to base and then after that we are going to go down to this spot and then that spot. But yeah, we do have to drop some stuff off. Love the stamina. Oh, what do we got? Where are you at? I hear you, hog. I hear you. I hear you, I just can't see you. Okay, well, you're minding your business. It's fine with me. But yeah, games like this I really love just because even in the newer games, Arma, whatever game you're playing, Arma 3 and all that stuff, and like the awesome graphics Hitman has and all that stuff, these graphics are so simple, but it helps keep the game running smooth and I don't, I don't know, I've just never really cared about graphics too much, so for me I'm like, this is perfect, where are we going? Lost my way, got spun around. Right. Oh, right, this ship. Okay, this is the next ship. And I said I wasn't getting to get into a bunch of side missions, so... I might kill these guys later, but for right now, we're just gonna go... Eh, fuck it. We're gonna kill them. Let's save again. Save again. I don't really need to, but it's just... It's just too easy.
Ты покойник! Attention, stalkers! An emission is approaching. I repeat, an emission is approaching. Seek cover immediately. Shit, there's a lot of good stuff here. I do not want to leave most of this stuff behind. Fuck. Let's take the good stuff. I think we can make it. You know what? I'm a, I'm a chicken shit, so I'm going to save again just in case we don't. Stalker, how are you? Hello! Hello. Here to trade some stuff. Um, Attention, stalkers! An emission will start any minute now. Find cover if Drop you want to live. something interesting comes up. Skidoff's won't be going anywhere, that's for sure. How big? What are you? A statue? If you got something, spill the beans. If not, take a hike.
Eh. You know, we're just gonna stick with the Beretta just cause. Yeah, we're just gonna stick with the Beretta. So, okay, that's good. Let's repair. Not really. Okay, let's repair these other guns, get them sold. Repair. That's expensive. Repair. Jeez, repair our body armor too. That's expensive. Okay, we repaired all this shit. <laughs> okay, so let's trade this. Basically made our money back on trading that shit. Uh, I want to trade that gas mask. I don't really know what it does, but... You start off with it, you don't really need it. Okay. Two grand for a helmet. I'll be good without that for now, I think. Got some ammo. Got some ammo for that. Not really. Okay. Yep. Not that. This, by the way. Protection. I do not need that artifact. So don't let, let the door. So, did you find anything no, out about the map? No. I've yes. asked everywhere, but it's useless. Goodbye. Nobody knows a thing. It's like it is a poltergeist or something. That son of a bitch is going to regret running away. Hang in there, buddy. The doc said you'll be up in your feet in a couple of days. You might as well use this time to rest up and chill. Sold all that shit. I don't want to sell that medical stuff too, I don't even care about that now. <coughs> Here is the doctor. And to you, sir, these are good for. I honestly don't really get what these do. Antidote when we sell all those. I'll hang on to this though. But I will not carry those around right now because we don't need the radiation pills in this area, really. So I'm going to actually toss all that in there. All the food except for two. Those as well. It's all about managing the weight. So. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. And we might run out and run right back. So. Ooh, these guys died. Let's loot them. Fuck yeah. Hello, they didn't make it back in time, so obviously the uh, radiation got them. That was a pleasant surprise. Anyone else die out here? No? Okay, well... <coughs> Watching me... Hello! Vodka. Okay, so that's not a bunch. Pop in if you find any artifacts and we'll see what we can do. Yeah, yeah, shut up. Back to the gunsmith. Let's repair this. Let's repair all this. Repair, so that's seven. Repair. Ooh, I don't know if we even get that much money for this shit. But we'll find out. We'll find out. That is a nice little submachine gun to have, actually, but. It's like an MP5 in the game, but, uh, <coughs> it's just about the weight. Trade. So, you so. got anything new? Two and a half pounds. It's one pound. One and a half pounds over for that. Eh, eh. Uh. I am gonna sell the handgun. 
just keep this instead. That's right. Get on out of here. Yeah, yeah, the voice acting is hilarious in this game. guys haven't despawned and all their gear is still here. Oh, we got some dead bodies over here. I can see on my mini map. We have what we have. Nothing. Somebody's already looted. Them. game I spend a lot of time like doing this sort of thing you know taking out everybody I can and it looks like they might have despawned there's a shotgun there but oh okay, no, no, no. you have nothing yeah they damn it they're gone the whole anomaly made them disappear I kind of remember that happening so oh well we got, we got some good stuff off of them anyway. So, let's head... What's closest? Ooh, I know one thing I do have to do. Right there. I have to go to the old barge. Yes. Because this guy tells us how to get to one of the crash sites by jumping through a little portal. <coughs> I don't think we have to go see him, but he does have a uh, semi-automatic shotgun. Uh, what do we have? You gonna bother me? Anyways, he's in here. I think his name is Ghost, if I remember right. And he's going to fire a warning shot at us when we open this door. Oop. I think that's from him coming inside. Let's save. And right here, he fires two shots at us. Mutant asshole! Peace off! We could talk to him, but actually, let's talk to him. Noah. Who is Ghost? Ghost is in Pripyat, that's right. This is where I can get grenades. Okay. 
We killed them. <coughs> we will take those. We'll just take everything he has, actually. So that's where those damn mutants are. They climbed up to the plateau thinking that Noah won't get to them. <laughs> I guess they don't know that I've got a personal path up there by the northern farmstead. You're in for a fun ride, assholes. Where is his expensive shotgun? Oh, there it is. And you know what? I don't even think I need to look up here. I don't think there was anything up here. So we got that. The plateau is... I believe the plateau is... Yes, that's the plateau, right? But, we will... Should we? Yeah, it's kind of a ways. Yeah, it's kind of... Oh, who's shooting at me? What do we got, people? Oh, people over here. Ну чё, ждём ещё ложки? Лимончики! tempting when they're so easy to kill. Other guy, there you are. You had nothing on you? Really? Wait, are you just... Okay, there we go. Alright, make sure we're heading in the right direction. There we go. Nope, getting hungry. Let's eat. There we go. shoot someone this close to the boat, the announcer comes on going, oh, we're shut down until there's this violence that stops outside or whatever. So we don't want to get locked out of here for, you know, 15 minutes or 20 minutes, whatever it is. Welcome aboard! I hate the voice acting. Okay, so, let's get rid of some of the bread. That, the vodka, that helps with radiation, the vodka does. But it's also very heavy, so. We'll sell that. Drop in if something interesting comes up. Scott I will, sir. Going How? Repair. Let's just repair everything. And then we'll sell it. One thing that's uh, always annoyed me about all the Stalker games, you can't sell weapons that are not in good condition. Like, sometimes they can be one or two points off, but... Um, like, if it's half durability, it won't let you sell it. It's like, can I just sell it for, like, I don't care, $25? Just let me get rid of it. I don't want to spend money to repair it, and then... What are you? A statue? If you got something, spill the beans. If not, take a hike. Fifty-one hundred. This? Why can't I sell this? The trader isn't interested in that item. Okay. Oh, more grenades. Let's get rid of 
those. Let's buy some AK ammo. Two grand for fucking 120 rounds. That's probably what ammo will be like in America in the next few years. <laughs> so we'll buy that. We got 100 rounds for that. Let's. Those armor piercing. Jacket is hollow points. Yeah, I'm doing just regular. Okay. Anyways, so. Noah's PDA. Noah's PDA. Sell for a thousand, sure. We just sold it. Cool. So I think we'll call it quits for here, not to too long tonight, but in the next episode we'll go to here. That'll teleport us down to here and then here, and then we go to the next zone. I don't know, maybe I'll... Mm, yeah, that, that might be it for this episode. And I will catch you all in the next one.